Alrighty, so I'm going to be showing you guys how to update your version of Keybot um, whenever a new update is out. Um, this is kind of the most efficient way and it also saves you, especially if you have a custom ran site. So whenever you have your Heroku repository cloned, as I shown, showed in the last tutorial, you usually just want to create a folder called Backup. It doesn't really matter what it's called, but you always want to make a backup. and there are three important things. So you want to um, keep your extras resources if you have one, your extras views f files, and also your config. So here I'm just going to back up the config over here. I'm just going to paste that in there. And in my views, I got an extras over here. So I'm just going to paste, or well, actually, just to save myself here. And then I will save if I got any here. I'll save those. And I'll just name it resources and paste that. And it's as simple as that. And then once you're all done, um, from top to bottom, you can just delete everything just to play it safe. And copy and paste everything here. And in this case, we already had a config, so we're just going to take our old one back. And then we're going to go back in here, get the resources that we made here, paste that right back in. We'll just replace that, whatever. And uh, go back, get our view, and then fix that up. So we'll replace that like that once you've done all of that and you have your config back in you're all set and then you can just push to Heroku so once you're in the directory just run git add whatever just Heroku git messages really mean nearly nothing and then like that, it's pushed, and you're all updated, so that's really it.